so today we've got several distinguished guests who would like an opportunity to speak. Uh, first, we'd like to hear from folks at the State Board of Education. This year, the legislature passed Senate Bill 5497. And uh, this gives students represented on the State Board of Education the right to vote on the board. I signed this bill on March 11th. But we're, since we're talking about education today, I wanted to uh, have these folks talk. I want to thank Senator Claire Wilson for sponsoring that bill. And I agree we should empower students and make sure their voices are heard. We're about to be joined uh, to be joined by Bill Kalapa, who's chairman of the Board of State of Education, followed by two high school students representatives on the board, Mackenzie Roberts from Okanagan High School and uh, uh, Pavan Venkata Krishna from Interlake High School in Bellevue. So let's start with Bill. Bill, you have the floor. Thank you, Governor. Thank you for this opportunity to be here today and celebrate. Uh, it's a day, uh, like you said, it truly is a day of celebration on behalf of our K-12 kids and all of us uh, in the education realm. Uh, I'd like to take a moment to start with a land recognition, if that's okay. I'd like to uh, recognize that in the state of Washington, we are fortunate uh, to be able to um, reside on the lands of 29 federally recognized tribes um, and some tribes who have not received federal recognition, but we really are lucky in the state of Washington to have access to all these uh, cultural treasures that we have in our state. So uh, thank you for allowing me to take the time to acknowledge our native people. Um, the basic outline of Senate Bill 5497, um, this bill comes at the request of the State Board of Education. We would like to thank the governor's office for supporting the state board in pursuing this request. Uh, we would also like to thank Senator Claire Wilson for her support and leadership in introducing, introducing and sponsoring this legislation. Uh, we also would like to thank Chair Santos and Wellman as well for their, their leadership in this regard as well. Um, the state board uh, of education consists of 16 board members. Uh, two of our members are high school students, as you know. Um, and we've been advocating for this for a while. Uh, students uh, before them have ad advocated for this as well. And we're finally at a point where uh, we can celebrate this. This extends voting authority of the student members so they can vote on board business uh, along with other members. Um, I know that I personally and, and others on us, others of us on the board uh, truly view our high school members as colleagues. Uh, and, and this solidifies that, it galvanizes that, it gives them a vote. Uh, our student board members work very hard in this role and have shown again and again that they can and should have not just a seat at the table, but a say in the decisions. Um, granting student members an official vote is a simple and fundamental way of making sure their input is not merely symbolic, but is truly valued uh, and impactful. This change will make the board more student-centered and responsive to people most directly impacted by the board's policy decisions. So thank you for this day. And thank you for this time, Governor. Well, thank you, and thanks for your work on this uh, important group. And uh, now we'd like to hear from uh, McKenna from the Okanagan Bulldogs. McKenna. Hello, thank you. Um, first, I'd like to extend a big thank you to Governor Inslee, as well as everyone who dedicated their time to advocating for this bill this session, from students to State Board of Education members, and especially legislators. Uh, my name is McKenna Roberts, and I'm a senior at Okanagan High School and I'm the Eastern Washington student representative on the state board. It's hard to believe, but I'm nearing the end of my term serving on the board. It's been so incredible the past two years and one of the best parts of my high school experience. Many board members pointed out to me that unfortunately this bill won't go into effect until after I'm done serving on the board. But truthfully, I'm not bothered by this. This bill means so much more than just Pavan and I being able to give a quick yay or nay at a board meeting. It's an inspiration for students throughout the state to know that their voices are being heard and taken into account in state policy decisions. My hope is to spur more civic engagement by students at the local level as well. My vision for student voice has drastically shifted since I first joined the board and it's incredibly satisfying to leave knowing that we made history. I have no doubt that future students on the board will continue to make history and continue to passionately advocate for students in Washington. Thank you very much. Thank you, Governor Inslee, for taking a moment during uh, today's event to recognize the student vote bill. I serve as the current uh, Western Washington student representative on the state board, and it's a real honor to be here today. I'd first like to thank the bill sponsors, uh, the student groups who testified in favor of this bill, the hardworking staffers at the State Board of Education, 
and the legislators in the Washington State Legislature who helped write this bill under the books of law. And we much made today the victory this represents for students, and it is one to be sure. But it's also a victory for teachers, for administrators, for educational leaders across the state. It means that educational policy and governance will be more informed, consensus-driven, and ultimately more effective. Democracy and government have always worked best when we incorporate as many voices as possible into the decision-making process. Representing over 1 million students throughout Washington State is an awesome responsibility for myself and McKenna and the student representatives who will come after us, but it's one we will take on gladly. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you for your leadership and thank you for being um, accommodating for older people and, and understand our limitations. So we appreciate that. Thanks for- No problem, thank you very much. <laughs> Looking forward to your career.